welcome to today's video. Hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. Today, me and hubby are on our way to, well, we're actually already in Glasgow, but we're stuck in a traffic jam. We are heading to Glasgow first for some breakfast, but then we are adventuring on to Loch Lomond. Um, we're staying at the lodge on Loch Lomond, which is, it looks like an amazing hotel. Uh, won't bore you anymore. We're gonna carry on with the drive. I might show you a bit of my breakfast because everyone likes a breakfast shot. And then we'll show you what we get up to while we're here. to Glencoe. We're actually um, heading down to the river to grab some water for the car because uh, we've, we've uh, it's quite quite um, filthy the screen at the moment so we need to get some screen wash. Um, it's Nick behind me. Who's Nick? Kind of adventure. So we've come down to this very quiet lock. It's really pretty round here. Some of the colours that you can see, the, the camera's just not doing it justice. Um, I'll, there's, I'll put up one of the pictures we've taken. Yep, so as you can imagine, standing here is pretty good. We're um, just sort of getting a feel for the area, but we've just been told by the hotel that we're staying at. The, the, um, lodge on Loch Lomond that our room is ready so we're gonna get checked in get our stuff um, unpacked and go and find something that's uh, around the local area and then uh, we're coming out on a hike in a little bit so let's go beach that's right near our hotel. It feels a bit weird to go into a beach. Lots of ducks having a lovely duck time. <laughs> it's pretty chilly still. Uh, we've just been to a local pub and had a bit of local food. Tried some local ale and now we're taking a lovely little stroll across the beach to the back to the hotel to have a bit of chill out before we go for dinner. an awesome night's sleep the first night that we've been here at Lodge on Loch Lomond and this morning we are off for our first little walk and we're going to see the Falls of Falloch which is supposed to be beautiful and then we're gonna go on a little trail and basically embrace the outdoors. We've now hit the car park at the Falls of Falloch and now we're gonna go see the Falls of Falloch. Behind this, 
find some more tails. Good. Just let you with your head down. So we're at the lock. No, we're at the inn. In Lock Moment, and we're going for some lunch. And Nick's gone for a sandwich. Well, just a little something. Just wanted a small nibble, didn't you? Oops. That looks tasty though. Yeah. For a little walk, hike. I don't know what you'd even call it. What would you call it? <laughs> yeah, kind of a hikey thing. It's up a hill. It's muddy. It's an interesting terrain. Bit of mud, bit of rock, bit of grass, bit of sliding. And it's raining, but it's cool. We get to the top of this hill steep at this bit. And it's just behind me. The view's incredible even if it is raining. But we're in Scotland in winter so we've done pretty well I'd say. Just let me negotiate. Note to self, bring walking poles when got up a hill. Oh this teased me. I thought it was the top. It's not. There's another bit to go. It's about 51 floors apparently according to my Samsung gear sport. Last bit. Last little bit. There it is. I think it's close behind. So what can I tell you about Lot Lomond and the winter? Pretty much that's something warm. Good trainers. Good walking boots. If you go for walking, poles, it's hilly. <laughs> Nick's trying out his new um, Columbia Montreal trainers. Uh, I've got another pair. I don't even remember, I bought some ages, got some ages ago. Um, I like them that much. Got them in the sale for 45 quid. So I've got two pairs of the same thing. And because they're nice and light and blue, I've managed to get mud all over them already. Right. Just concentrate on this last little bit. Turn you around. As we go up. Look at this. Look at my trainers. Alright. He was incredible. Nearly at the top. View so far. Excuse my hard breath. It's quite hilly. Thanks, Dave. All that cloud house there. Right, apparently that, this isn't the top, that's the top. So we made it, we're at the top. Oh. Oh. That's the view behind us. That's so pretty, even if it is raining and quite cold. Taste something you don't get that in Loughborough. <laughs> Pretty cool. Lord. Tea room. Oh. Tea room. Oh. Okay, we're going to the pub. <laughs> pub. <laughs> okay, let's go. To so, the pub. so I think we're going to go find a local pub. Um, maybe try some of the. Is it what's the brewery called? Lock. 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 <laughs> Which brewery is the brewery? Where are we? Lot Lomond! So if you were going to start a brewery here, what would you call it? <laughs> Lot Lomond Brewery! There you go. So yeah, we're going to go and see if we can find some sort of uh, local local beer and uh, might have a cup of tea. So old. Right, I'm going to try and negotiate down this hill. So today is our last day in Lot Lomond and it's been fantastic. It might look a little bit bleak outside but it's still pretty gorgeous from this hotel balcony. 
It's been raining, but it was expected to be quite honest, so I'm pretty happy. We've had a lovely time. I think we'd love to come back in the summer. Um, oh, you can go see a bit better. I'd love to come back in the summer. Um, I'd love to try stand up paddle boarding here. I'd love to swim in the, in the uh, lake as well, in the lock, sorry, uh, as well. And yeah, it's just been a pretty wicked trip. Nice walks around here. It's just been very, very chilled. Definitely what you need. Um, I don't know what it would be like in the summer. I guess it would probably be a very different atmosphere. You get people who can really embrace the Scottish weather here at the moment. But um, I imagine it's perhaps a little bit more lively, a bit more going on, a bit more things to do in the summertime. That's what I say, you can't do anything. Lots of walks, cycling, just relaxing really, and that's perfect. So a big thanks to um, Lodge on Loch Lomond for having us. It's been fantastic, the hotel's been great, the service has been impeccable, and we've really enjoyed it. And I hope you've enjoyed this video. So thanks from me and Nick, wherever he's disappeared to, I think he's loading the car. Um, and we hopefully we'll catch up with you soon. And of course, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Take care, bye.